Good. Well, I'm glad it has opened your mind and heart, and I'm glad you don't feel hate. That's a very good sign, and, and uh, love is what it is all about. And, uh, and so uh, that, that's the solution. There is only one God, whether you call him Elohim or Allah or Shakti or Buddha, there's only one. And this is what I, I have always loved about the Sufis and their attempt to uh, influence Islam by the great ones, they have been Arabi and Rumi and, and the ones the poets were reading, is that they have said very clearly, ours is a religion of love, not a religion of legality and, uh, and, and belief in uh, jihad of, a, of, of a, a kind of conquest for a belief system, but for love that recognizes the same God in the synagogue and in the mosque and in, uh, in the pagoda or wherever, and, and that in the tavern and uh, everywhere, right? So it's, it's that uh, recognition that love is our duty, not uh, 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 combat and violence and, and killing for Christ or Allah or for Moses or for whoever. Uh, it, we are not commanded to kill, quite the contrary. I, my reading of the Ten Commandments is thou shalt not kill. Uh, and, uh, you know, that's, that's uh, what we are to follow. So uh, all, everyone is, is breaking with the, the real commandment that all religions have promulgated, which is the, the law of love. And, uh, and that's what we have to return to, but we can only return to it if we reach the consciousness of that which is real, our soul in relation to God, not the ego in relation to the external other, and that has been mind controlled into demonizing that other. Okay, so, thank you, Father.